video we are going to see about robert koch robert heinrich ermen koch robert koch was a german physician and microbiologist one of the main founders of modern bacteriology koch created and improved laboratory technologies and techniques in the field of microbiology the nobel prize in physiology or medicine 1905 was awarded to robert koch for his investigation and discoveries in relation to tuberculosis robert koch introduced staining techniques smearing techniques methods for obtaining bacteria in pure culture using solid media koch also invented the apparatus and the procedure for hanging drop technique he discovered specific causative agents of anthrax tuberculosis and cholera robert koch became the first to link a specific bacterium with a specific disease while maintaining a clinical practice he began investigating a major health problem anthrax studies had shown that rod shaped structures were present in the blood of animals died of anthrax and that the disease could be transmitted by inoculating healthy animals with blood from diseased animals certain pastures were known to be dangerous to grazing livestock and could remain so for years it little was known about the rod shaped structures or about the nature of soil derived diseases robert koch studied anthrax using mice guinea pigs rabbits dogs etc he discovered that inoculating a mouse with blood from a sheep that had died of anthrax caused the mouse to die the following day at autopsy rod shaped structures were present in the blood lymph nodes and spleen inoculation of a second mouse with splenic blood from the first mouse produced the same result the rods were varied in length cock hypothesized that these were living bacteria after a few days bacteria laden blood lost its ability to cause disease robert cock developed techniques of artificial culture that allowed him to observe changes in bacteria over time he found that inoculating the cornea of a rabbit with bacteria laden fluid caused changes in the aqueous humor the translucent fluid became turbid with bacteria thus he discerned an effective medium for culturing bacteria by placing a piece of infected splenic tissue in a drop of aqueous humor and sealing it on a concave slide he created a living environment that allowed him to observe bacterial growth over days he discovered that under optimal conditions the bacteria would form long filaments the filaments acquired granules which developed into refractile spheres the filaments then decomposed but the spheres remained when the fluid was dried and then reconstituted with aqueous humor bacteria emerged from the spheres robert koch hypothesized that the spheres were spores he demonstrated that these spores in the absence of bacteria could cause anthrax their formation explained how contaminated soil could remain toxic for years having discovered the importance of spores 
in the pathogenesis of disease robert koch recommended that diseased animals be burnt or buried in soil to prevent spore formation robert koch became the first to link a specific bacterium with a specific disease he presented his experiments to ferdinand korn germany's most renowned botanist korn published robert koch's paper in his own botanical journal in 1876 the golden age of bacteriology and its impact on medicine had begun friends i'm concluding this video here see you soon in my next video which will be the continuation of this video thank you friends